you go all the way down the line and there's there's plenty of people to learn from so I think that's just kind of what I do or tried to do and just kind of be a sponge. How, I mean, was it difficult when you, you, you win the Stanley Cup in 2012, you know, regular all 20 games in that postseason run and then that 12-13 season, you know, there, were, there were maybe a week or two stretches. I know you got you, there was an upper body injury early in the year and there were probably a stretch or two where you know you weren't in the lineup. I mean, how was it was it difficult that that particular season for you personally? Uh, Ultimately, it turned out to be a fine season yeah. for the Kings. Yeah, you know, I was... Obviously, as a player, you want to play, and you know, that was frustrating. But um, you know, I just take the experience and, and, and learn from it. And at some point or another, virtually everybody's going to have to go through a, a stretch like that and um, fight through some adversity. And, uh, and I just, I just take it as that. Appreciate it, Alex. Thanks. Alex, uh, you guys just put, you put a little past the quarter, quarter, quarter mark of the season. Uh, I heard, yeah. Where you guys at? Where do you guys still need to go? Um, I don't think that we're nearly satisfied with uh, with our level of play right now. I think um, I think that we're we're getting better, but I think that we you know we got to have a little bit more consistency. You know, there's there's been some uh, some big games that we've had that um, you know we weren't necessarily happy with our performance and um, maybe we've come up short. So uh, I, I don't think that there's really. I think if if you're if you're satisfied at this point of the year, then there's, you know, I don't. I think there's something wrong there. Um, I think that you know, see, the season is a process, and um, you know, you just got to develop your game and and, and uh, you know, make sure that you're playing your best hockey when you're coming down the the home stretch. What needs to change for you guys to, to get to that level of consistency that you're, that you're shooting for? Um. I think it's just consistently playing our game and, and, and doing the things that we do well. Uh, you know, you you obviously have ups and downs during the season. And that's going to happen, you know, all the time. But you just you want to try to not get too get too high or, or stay too low. And um, yeah, I think it's just you know honing our our style of game in terms of you know making quick decisions in the D zone and, and getting pucks in deep and 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 staying you know keeping that keeping that focus and the attention to detail because at the end of the day that that's what's make the that's what makes the difference. Four game road trip. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know if you, you look at it. How, how do you look at it? Do you look at it as well? Hey, okay, this is this is a trip. We got to get six out of eight points or anything like that. You just got one game. Five gamer, isn't it? I thought it was four. I think it's five. But, um, uh, I mean, no, you, I mean, every night you want to go in and you want to get two points. You don't, you don't look at a section of games and say, you know, well, we just want to come out with three wins or, you know, I, you don't, you don't do that. But, um, you know, this is going to be a tough test for us. We're, we're, we're going to a lot of tough buildings, you know, um, you know, Buffalo's not an easy place to play. You got Ottawa, Montreal, and St. Louis in there, and you know we, we've always had you know big battles with with them. And um, you know it's it's an opportunity to uh, you know take that next step. And uh, um, you know you need you need to have good road trips throughout the year, play well on the road.